and welcome back to Let's Play Fantasy Life. So, it's like 3 in the morning in game. Perfect time to go learn how to be a tailor. So yeah, I'm gonna work on starting off the uh, tailor life this one. This one? This episode. Because I want to make myself some pretty good armor for my wizard. Because right now we are very, very squishy. And I want to fix that. So yeah, pretty much all of the crafting lines except for alchemy and cooking start in this building right here. So the tailor guy is right back here. Well, tailor guy. Tailor women. Madam Pearl. Madam Pearl is right here. He's adorable. Yeah, it's fine. We can ignore him. But yep, let's learn how to be a tailor, shall we? And yeah, we're going to continue with this quest. It's our first crafting one, so we might as well. Because crafting for all of them kind of works the same. They use the same like materi er, same material, same uh, mechanics. But yeah, we got ourselves a needle now. I'm going to poke things with it. Alright, so dandelion cotton. So yeah, remember all that dandelion puff we've been carrying? This is where it finally comes into play. We can turn it into cotton. Oh, don't worry, madam. I have dandelion puffs. I have all of the dandelion puffs. But yep, we just need to make some cotton. Pretty simple. So first things first, let's equip uh, that needle and thread we just got. So yeah, it's considered a... T wait, that's right. I don't actually know how to sew yet. One second. Hi, Spoolie. Are there dandelion puffs in your ears? I would kind of like to have those if you don't mind. It's a royal decree. Am I actually going to have to go find some dandelion puffs? I have dandelion puffs. Uh, the game is going to have to is going to make me have to go grab more, isn't it? Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, despite the fact that I have them, the game won't let me use them. Okay, fine. We're gonna have to go talk to Taylor. I see what they did there. But yeah, he's over in the West Castile. So, let's go find them. Hopefully they're still up. It's like, what, 3, 30, 4 o'clock at this point? Fortunately, we don't have to sleep or take care of any needs. We can just go forever without sleeping if we want to. With absolutely no ill effects. We're special like that. Also, yeah, I can run now. I forgot. I'm not carrying anything with me anymore. Alright, so where are they? They are hiding to the south of us. Wait. Wait. Alright, where are they? Okay, they're right near the church. Also, I'm gonna stop running so I can save some SP. Hi there! You know... At first I thought it was a spooky that was keeping the priest up, but it might be the fact that Taylor is standing outside his house at 4 in the morning, singing at the top of his lungs. Hi there! Actually, I think that... I forget if Taylor is male or female. Why don't you have a face? Oh no, you do have a face. Your eyes are just completely covered up by your hair. Spoonie, what are you doing here? How'd you get here before us? We kind of just made a beeline here. Actually, it might have been faster to go from the south entrance. But yeah, Spoolie is the best.
Bye, Spoolie. Listen, I don't know how to talk. But yeah, we need dandelion puffs. Oh, more dandelion puffs. Awesome. Only two, though. Man, I thought you were going to give me like 20. But yeah, we ourselves some dandelion puffs. Let's head back. I think I still have like 20 in my inventory, so we can make ourselves a ton of cotton if I need to. I think we're also going to need to- oh wait, one second, free carrots. I think at some point we're going to need to actually buy some materials to like buttons and stuff. I forget if you can craft those via carpentry. I usually just buy them because they're super cheap. I think you might have to buy them actually now that I think about it. Or find them somehow. But let's head back to the workshop. By the time we're done with this, it'll probably be around dawn. And then people will start coming out and we can turn in all those quests we picked up. Oh, that reminds me. I also need to uh, see Jinx at some point to turn in all those quests. We have a lot of stuff to turn in to no uh, tomorrow morning. Actually, Jinx is up all night. But yeah, we we'll might as well wait until morning and do it all at once. Hi, Spoolie. Also, how did Madame Pearl know you were missing? You're standing right next to her. But yep, time to learn how to craft stuff. And we learned how to sew. But yeah, I'll explain this in a second. Whoops. Basically, crafting is a mini game in this one. It's pretty simple and they all use the same basic mechanics. So yeah, before we do this though, we actually need a needle equipped. There we go. Alright, time to craft. So yeah, for crafting you need to, well, challenges here. Basically with the challenges, you can just look at what you need to do to get stars. Same as every single other life. I keep trying to call them jobs. They're not jobs in this game. They're lives. Also, we can access our storage from here. And yeah, you can actually craft stuff with, you can craft with stuff straight from storage. You don't have to have them in your inventory. So while we're here, I'm going to stick everything into stores that I don't need. So I don't have to worry about my inventory. Which is, oh wait, no, I need that. No, no, I don't. Never mind. I need to make sure I don't put away the stuff I need to turn for my quest. Uh, I need that. Oh, did I accidentally put away my honey? No, I didn't. Okay, yeah, that's good enough. So yeah, we can still craft with it even if it isn't in our inventory, which is good. So basically, if you don't need it with you at all times, just put it away. But yeah, we only know how to make dandelion cotton at the moment, so let's make some. Eventually we'll be to mass produce it, but for now we can only make it one at a time. So in this game, crafting is pretty much a series of mini games. They're all pretty simple. This one's just mash A, the other one was time A, and the other one's gonna be, I think, hold A? Actually, I don't think you have to hold one in, uh, in sewing. And we pretty much just have to do them as quickly as possible to get completion up to 100 before time runs out. And if we, I think if we do it quick enough and we're good enough at sewing, we can actually make high quality items, which are just better. That's it. They're just straight up better than what than uh, normal items. Yep, I made some pretty good cotton cloth. Sorry, dandelion cloth. All right, so let's see. Should we be worried about Spoolie? Alright, well, guess we're helping out- Ooh! Oh, that's a pretty cute outfit. I want to wear it. It has a bow tie and everything. Bow ties are cool. I don't think we can actually wear that normally, now that I think about it. But yeah, let's go talk to Taylor, I guess. Uh, they are over at Zippy's shop. I forget who's it. Oh, Zippy's the clothing shop lady. Okay. Well, let's go. They should be open by now, right? Mm. 
Have we been to the fashion boutique? I think we have been there, but we haven't really done any shopping. Yeah, here we go. They're right here. Hi there. Oh, hi Taylor, not you. Hi Zip. Hi. Nope. Why can't I talk to Zippy? There we go. For some reason, it kept auto locking to Taylor there. Oh, I thought you were. I thought we had to make a shirt. Anyways, hi Zippy. Why are there two of you? Alright, well, time to make some curtains, I guess. That's not a curtain, but okay. We'll make ourselves a fluffy ribbon top. Alright, so we have plenty of dandelion cotton, and we need a fluffy ribbon. Also, they're lying. Fluffy ribbon is actually pretty easy to find. We can just go straight up buy it. Alright, time to go do some shopping. Fortunately, in this area, the workshop is literally right outside of the marketplace. Where you're gonna get most of your materials that you need to buy. So it's not that long of a journey. Here we go. No, Taylor, we have plenty of dandelion cotton. We have more than enough dandelion cotton. Okay, free dandelion cotton, that's fine. Thank God we don't have to pay for it this time. Ooh, are you gonna give me free stuff? Man, wait, I thought you could always just buy fluffy ribbon just straight up from the shop. Fine, I'll make it. Okay, fine, we'll have to ask another tailor to make it for us. Uh, from Port Porto. That's the uh, third new area that we can go to at some point. Well, second, but we'll get there eventually. He's off to find woolly material, so he's gonna go... <laughs> Is he going to the East Grassy Plains to beat up sheep? There are easier ways to get wool, buddy. But yeah, we need to go find them. Is it going to take me all the way to the East Grassy Plains? No, it's just going to take me to the south of town. Okay. Actually, that's worse. Those sheep belong to someone. I mean, it would be good if you just went out and beat up wild sheep for their wool, but... Those sheep are someone's property. This is illegal. Well, maybe he's just buying the wool from the farmer at 5 in the morning. Should I be worried? There you are. Yep, I'm a tailor. I started like two hours ago. At least he's nice about it. But yeah, we need some fluffy ribbon, please. Yes. Yes, we are. At least I am. Okay, well, we have plenty of sheep fleece. On oh, wait, no, I think I put it in storage. Yeah, I think I ha Oh, no. All right, we'll have to get some free ones. Oh, hey! I guess we could just uh, ask for it from the sheep directly. All right, well, thanks, sheep buddy. Thank God all the animals around here can talk. All right, uh, let's give him the fleece we just got then. Awesome. Uh, wait, what song? Oh, 
Oh, that happened. Well, got ourselves some uh, fluffy ribbon then. Kind of impressive that you made this by hand. Out here in the middle of the field at 5 in the morning. It should be pretty dark around here. But yeah, got ourselves the ribbon, got ourselves the cloth. Let's go make ourselves a nice shirt. Alright, back to the workshop we go. Come along, Taylor. Just gonna dash all the way there. Eventually our dashing uh, skill is gonna be high enough that this won't drain so much SP every single time. Okay, there we go. Actually, I forget if we need SP to... I don't think you actually need SP to craft in this game. It's only for fighting and gathering. Hey, Spoolie. We got the materials we needed. And we learned how to make clothing. Awesome. So, let's do this. Unfortunately, party members won't help you craft, which would have been an awesome thing, but nope. Gotta do it all ourselves. Alright, so let's do this. Just need to make myself a new shirt. Unfortunately, we don't know how to make anything else, but that's okay. Alright, so we need to use a sewing machine. It's all about timing. Just get it when it hits the center. Yeah, I didn't do that one very well, unfortunately. There we go. And then uh, one more for cutting. Awesome. But yeah, you can switch between the stations by using L and R. We made ourselves a fluffy top. Wait. Oh, right, we have to turn this into Zippy. Man, I thought we were going to turn it into uh, our boss, but nope. I completely forgot this is actually something we were making for someone else. Well, it makes sense. We're literally a block away from your shop. Oh, my shirt. I was going to wear that. Oh well, we got paid for it, so guess it doesn't matter. We'll probably be spending that money on materials at some point, but for now, perfect. Awesome. Well, mission complete. We learned how to be a tailor in a single night. Yes, his name was Chuck. But yep, former student of yours taught us how to make ribbon. Well, he didn't teach us anything. He made ribbon for us. Well... I have heart. My skill is still pretty low because I have almost no dexterity, but that's okay. Yeah, don't, don't mind him. I'm kind of worried about Spoolie, to be honest. If he's not even allowed to leave. But yeah, we learned how to make fabric, which we'll need to make clothing. And we learned how to make miscellaneous things like hats and boots. And patches. But yep, there we go. We are now officially a tailor. And now we can start crafting up some good armor for our wizard. Which I think I'm going to do right now. Or at least I'm going to try to make as much as I can. But we are now a tailor. It's also important to try to unlock uh, jobs whenever you can. Er, jo I keep saying jobs. Lives whenever you can. Simply due to the fact that during a main story quest like time, you're not allowed to unlock any new lives. You're only stuck with the ones you've already unlocked. Alright. So, let's do a bit of crafting, shall we? Also, it's <laughs> it's dawn. Perfect timing. 
So yeah, let's just make a couple of pieces of equipment for ourselves. Eventually we'll want to get some straw thread. We can actually just buy that, but eh. So what are we missing right now? Dan okay, we need to make some dandelion cloth first off. Actually, you know what? I don't have to be a tailor to craft. I can craft as a wizard. So it might be better if I did as a wizard so I can compare the equipment. I do want to make a beret though. I need sheep fleece. I have that. Actually, I need green bell. I don't have the flower I need for that one. Shoes. Ooh, a cape would be nice, but I need straw thread. Yeah, I need to get a bunch of materials to make the any good equipment, unfortunately. I want this. I need to make a cute ribbon. Okay, or not make a cute ribbon. I need to go buy a cute ribbon. Okay, you know what? Let's do a bit of shopping then. I'm going to switch job lives real quick so I can be a wizard. Actually, no. I should do it as a tailor. Simply due to the fact that these skills as a tailor, or our stats as a tailor are better for it. Alright, so let's grab a few things then. So I want some straw thread. I'm going to buy like four of those. We don't need any sheep, please. We have plenty of that. Uh, and I need a couple of cute ribbons. I'm going to grab two of those. I don't think there's anything else I can grab. I can make myself bear needles through blacksmithing, so I'm not going to worry about that for now. I think I need string for a few things. Unfortunately, we can't get enough for that fancy beret. Oh well. I don't think any of the shops around here sell it either. No, I don't think- actually, wait. Do you sell, uh, flowers? I don't think anyone sells flowers. No, you're not selling the flower I need. This is all alchemy stuff. Okay. Oh then, let's go craft up some nice clothing then that we can start wearing as a wizard and look absolutely ridiculous while doing, but that's okay. That's half the fun. Alright, so the first thing I need to do is I need to make myself some extra cloth. So let's make another batch. We have plenty of dandelion puffs, so we don't ever have to worry about materials for making cloth. At least early on. Later on, we'll be switching to other types of uh, cloth. Also, I'm not doing this very good. That's okay. Yeah, I'm just not doing very well right now. There we go. Made some dandelion cloth. And we got an extra one. Awesome. Alright, so let's uh, make something else now. So now that we have plenty of cloth, we should be able to make that kilt. There it is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we can make- oh no, we- no way, no, we do have the materials for this. Never mind. I think we need one more- yeah, we need to make one more cloth after this. Okay. I really wish I could make the beret, but unfortunately, yeah, I don't have the materials for it. I'll have to make sure I keep an eye out- Oh my god. I think just look it's because I'm looking at the capture screen instead of the actual DS screen. Did I'm screwing that up so much? Yeah, that's entirely it. There we go. So yeah, I just need to remember to actually look at the actual DS whenever I'm doing this. Oh hey, we actually made it high quality. Somehow. But yeah, because it's a good quality item, it has better stats. And some quests will ask you specifically for high, uh, high quality items. Yeah, I need to make another dandelion cotton. Uh, what else can I make? Also, what are even the stats on this thing? Defense. Not bad. Yeah, let's make one more dandelion uh, cotton then. Eventually, like I said, we'll be able to mass produce this and not have to worry about doing this every single time. There we go. Oh, right, this one requires two... Wait, what? Oh, yeah, it requires two steps. I didn't see the steps in the corner there, and I was kind of confused for a second there. That's fine. We made dandelion cotton. And we made three. Also, yeah, since we made so many of them, now we can just craft them in bulk. So we can make multiples just by doing it once. Alright, so let's just quickly make ourselves that top. 
And then maybe I can see if I can make myself a good hat. Otherwise, I think that'll do for now. I want to see if I can also make myself that cape, too. I'll check once I'm done here. Oops. There we go. Perfect. Please be good quality. Uh, n oh yeah, good quality Highline uh, top. Man, we are just killing it here. All right, I don't think there's anything else I can really make at the. Actually, wait, can I make myself a cape? I forget if capes show up. Uh, and on your actual character model. No, I'm missing. Oh, I'm missing a red ball. Okay, yeah, I need to go flower picking at some point. Maybe next time I'm on the grassy plains, I'll do some flower picking. Otherwise, that's everything I can make at the moment. Yeah, we need flowers. But, got ourselves some, uh, new equipment. Let's switch over to wizard, turn in a few things, and then we'll call it an episode. And then after that, I think it's about time we actually went home. We've kind of been out for a while. But yeah, we are switching back to... Wizard. I'm a wizard now. Where's my hat? Wait, what happened to my hat? It's right there. I don't know why that got unequipped. But yeah, now we can put on this highland top. The magic defense is worse, but... Now we can wear pants. So yeah, in exchange for magic defense, we're getting higher normal defense. Also, we look absolutely dapper. Can I put on bare shoes? No, these are the best shoes I have on right now. Also, I should probably equip this charm that I completely forgot to equip. Whoops. But yeah, we are looking pretty good. Nice bow tie and a kilt. And the wizard hat. Doesn't really match up with the rest of the outfit, but that's okay. We'll make ourselves a good hat at some point. But yeah, let's go turn in a couple of these quests now. Uh, do you have a quest? No, wait, not you. I think you had a quest that I could turn in. Yep, here we go. Here's your grasshopper. Yes, that is true. And we got some apples for that. Awesome. And 200 dosh. Even better. Do you want another cap or no? You have a quest, but I think I'm going to pick that up next time. We are starting to run a bit on the later side for this uh, one. You know what? I'll probably turn in the uh, other quest some other time then. Actually, no. While we're here. You want honey, didn't you? Here's your honey. Sorry for making you wait like two days for this. Hopefully your pancakes are still good. Thank god there's no time limit on these quests. You can technically wait like months to give them the honey. Alright. But yeah, let's go level up wizard. That's something that's actually super important that I want to do right now. Alright, let's go see Jinx. It's been a while since we've seen her. And by a while I mean like... Two episodes? Hi, Jinx. Here, let me just report to you a few things I've done in the last, like, few days. So, I beat up a bunch of stuff with magic. I killed a bunch of weedlings. I killed a bunch of frogs. I beat up a few ghosts, and that's pretty much it. But, yep, now we are an apprentice wizard. So, we get a bear stat boost. Yep, bear stat boost. And now we have access to new spells, I think. Yeah, there we go. Awesome. So yeah, we have access to a couple new spells now. I don't think I can show them off here. No, I can't. We're not in a combat area. Okay. Well, next time we're in a combat area, I think we can try some of the new things we unlocked. But for now, I think we'll end the episode here. One second. I think we'll end the episode here. So, next time on Let's Play Fantasy Life, I think it's about time we went home and reported all that- one second. We went home and reported all that new stuff that we did to Butterfly. Well, she's been with us the entire time, but we should probably do a bliss check. So, till then. That came out weird.